Well, that's going everybody. It's Patrick Midton Outdoors. How's my outdoor crew doing? I'm here at Cedars Lebanon State Park, picnic area, um, beautiful area. I'll turn the camera so you can see it. It's a real pretty area up here. Quiet. All these cars in the parking lot down here on the trail over there, trailhead. So, I want to talk to you a little bit. Um, first off, I want to apologize for some of the videos that have been up here lately. I know they're crap. I know they're crap. Um, I've been in this block creative block where I can't think of things to create I want to know do you run into that situation where you just can't think of what to shoot and it's kind of funny it's it's been a little bit of don't know what to shoot next combined with um, the heat it's been really hot it's actually a nice blustery 68 degrees but it's a cool 68 degrees the humidity is gone and that's the other thing you're familiar with the south i mean humidity like is just ridiculous um so i, I kind of between july and mid-september kind of shut things down which kind of sucks for me because i'm an outdoor channel and dead of winter is usually when I do used to do gun stuff gun related stuff and I quit doing the gun related stuff um, but I've come up with this creative block that I didn't know what to create next and usually when that happens and this is kind of ironic and funny at the same time usually when this happens when this creative block kicks in and I'm like what to do next um, Bill will call and say, hey, we're going off-road, you want to go? Yeah, maybe that'll spur the next sets of videos. And, you know, we did the Prentice Cooper trip, and, you know, I was kind of, the, the gears had shifted a little bit, and then it's like somebody threw it in park again, and I couldn't think of that next video. So I guess I'm going to ask is, do, do you... Does anybody else have this issue? Do you have the same problem of what to create next? What do I want to shoot next? Where do I want to shoot next? You know, I, I had quit the gun stuff on my channel because I'd gotten some negative feedback on it. And, you know, I had, uh, was trying to, well, I guess not appease everybody, but at the same time, I was doing it for the channel's health. Um, I did it for the channel's health. Um, but when we went and shot anywhere, we did some indoor ranges in the winter. We did some outdoor ranges in the spring and summer and stuff. But we haven't done any of that in forever. Um, I know I used to do a lot of hiking, but ever since I got di you know diagnosed with diabetes, blood sugar, and all that crap, and then the neuropathy kick in and my as far as my being able to hike far distances has like been down to nothing I, I mean you know I can set up a tent at the campsite and I can walk around the campsite with no problem but if I was to go try to knock out this hike that's right over here that you can't see is about five miles long I bet I couldn't even do a third of that right now. I bet I couldn't even... I bet if I went down there and started it, I would have to turn around and come back. And it's just... I think it's a little bit up here too. But with the neuropathy, if nobody's ever explained this to you, or if you've had it or never had it or don't know what it's about, but you lose sensation in your feet and what your feet are doing, your, your, your balance, everything. And... You know as well as I do, some of these trails can be kind of rough and and uh, be very difficult. So that kind of took another aspect out of my channel of things I did. Um, 
I think y'all are liking the exploring videos where we go explore these back gravel roads and roads to nowhere that lead to some some of the coolest scenery I've you know I've seen in a long time. Um, I know there's cooler scenery if you can walk to it, but I, you know I can't walk to it. So I guess I'm reaching out and saying, you know, what do you guys want to see back on the channel within, you know, within my capabilities? And my capabilities, as far as hiking goes, are just about gone. And I hate that. And trust me, I have talked to the doctors about it, and they've talked about doing different things. And I don't know. I, I just, we'll see how that comes out. But this creative block of what to do next just really irks me I'm trying to form my words without four letter words okay so probably gonna end it right there let me know what you else you would like to see on the channel outdoor related you know whatever you know what i've done in the past is there something i don't do that you would like to see more of please let me know i mean i'm making this a tuesday video because i am honestly I'm at that point of what to do next. Now I've got camping trips planned and I've got things for those trips that I want to show you eventually, but I want to do it in a different setting. So anyway, I hear the rain coming again. I'm calling this day a done one because this is third time I've been somewhere and it started raining. So that tells me it's time to go home. But I, I you know, I'm not a fair weather camper either. I, you know, the rain doesn't bother me camping. I know how to prepare for it. I know how to deal with it. Um, you know, I shot a video a little while ago um, and I had to put the umbrella up and it did really good. I, I stayed dry, but it wasn't a real hard rain. So I don't know, you know, it, it may leak eventually. I don't know. Um, I have sprayed that thing with... Uh, water repellent so i don't know anyways guys please help me out any way you can let me know what you would like to see on the channel what else you would like to see what you would like to see me go back to and um, i'd be glad to do it all right guys that's it for this one let me know if you have that creative block and you can't quite figure out what to do next be prepared see you on the next one